Welcome to the Euro Cuisine Kitchen, where delicious food is created with ease. Today I'm going to show you how to make fresh and healthy yogurt using the Euro Cuisine YM80 yogurt maker. Are you ready for a fresh start? Let's make some yogurt. All you need are two simple ingredients. First ingredient, two to three ounces of plain yogurt at room temperature, or a five gram packet of Euro Cuisine yogurt culture, plus five and a quarter cups of your favorite milk. That's about 42 ounces. You can use any type of milk, whole, skim, or low fat, pasteurized or raw. You can also use almond milk, soy milk, or even goat's milk. Prepare an ice bath in your kitchen sink. No more than a few inches of cold water and ice cubes. Remove the white caps from the seven glass jars in your Euro Cuisine yogurt maker. We won't need them until the yogurt is cooked. Pour your milk into a saucepan. Heat the milk. Whisk frequently to avoid charring. When the milk starts to bubble or reaches 180 degrees Fahrenheit, it's ready. Place the saucepan into the ice bath and cool it to 100 degrees Fahrenheit. That's about the same temperature one would feel comfortable feeding this milk to a baby. Remove one cup of the milk from the saucepan and pour the rest in a pitcher. Stir in the yogurt or yogurt culture with the one cup of the warm milk. Today I'm using all natural plain yogurt as my starter. Now it might seem strange that you need to buy yogurt to make yogurt, but what we're doing is we're introducing good probiotic bacteria to the milk. These bacteria thrive in heat, and that's exactly what your yogurt maker is going to provide. Now all you do is you take the mixture, you pour it in with the warm milk in your pitcher, and then simply give it a stir. Pour the final mixture into the seven glass jars in equal amounts. Place the open jars into the Euro Cuisine YM80 yogurt maker. Remember, we're saving the individual white jar lids for later. Place the clear cover over the maker. Check the handy time reminder printed on the side of the machine. I want to cook this batch for eight hours, so I'm going to align my indicator on the clear lid with the time I expect it to be finished. This will remind me what time I should turn it off. It's 1 p.m., so I'm going to add eight hours and align my indicator with the number nine. Plug in your yogurt maker and turn on the machine to begin cooking your batch. It's that easy. Eight hours later, simply turn off the unit, remove the clear lid, and twist the white lids onto each glass jar. Refrigerate the glass jars. The yogurt will stay fresh for at least 10 days. The YM80 has enough glass jars to provide one serving every day for a week. My family loves yogurt, so we make a new batch every other night. Now when the jars have chilled for at least three hours, your yogurt is ready to eat. You can enjoy chilled yogurt straight out of the jar, or you can add it to your favorite cereal.
Hi, I'm Teresa with Cuisinart, and this is Cuisinart's frozen yogurt, ice cream, and sorbet maker. This unit holds up to one and a half quarts of your favorite dessert. It comes with three basic parts. The first is the freezer bowl. This is a double insulated freezer bowl, um, which needs to be in the freezer for up to eight hours. Um, I'd prefer to keep it in the freezer overnight to make sure that it's uh, solid, solidly frozen. And it goes right here on the base. It requires no ice, so there's no, no mess, no fuss. This is our patent pending mi mixing paddle, which goes right here inside of the freezer bowl. Um, and it makes uh, ice cream or any frozen dessert in 20 minutes or less. And then here, is the cover, which has a large spout right here, which allows you to add any mix in towards the end of your, if you're making ice cream, you wanna add ch chocolate chips. Um, it's wide enough um, for you to add that to your ice cream. And um, there you have it, that's our, our ice cream maker. And it makes, as I said, it makes a uh, great uh, sherbet, uh, sorbet, ice cream. Cuisinart's frozen yogurt ice cream and sorbet maker.